JC Manayana. The following commentary I'm about to give is by Ramanuja Dasa Sriman Gattu Venu Gopal Swami. Chapter 8 Akshara Parabrahma Yoga Sloka 10 Prayana Kale Manasa Chalena Bhaktiya Yukto Yoga Bale Na Chaiva Bhruvor Madhye Pranam Avesya Samyak Satam Param Purusham Vupaiti Divyam Om Gita Charya, Sri Krishna Paramatma, is teaching Akshara Parabrahma Yoga to all of us along with Arjuna. Paramatma is saying, Arjuna, I am explaining the Upasana or meditation procedure to be performed by those who seek wealth or lordship from me. At the time of their death, they should remember me as a Supreme Personality, having excellent virtues, excellent qualities, excellent divine attributes, and a divine auspicious image. Not only should they remember me, but they should also visualize me between the eyebrows. To visualize me between the eyebrows, they need to fix their prana, life breath, between the eyebrows. Is it possible to do that? Yes, it is possible with the strength of bhakti yoga, which is formed due to the devotion they have in me and due to the meditation they have been doing on me throughout their life. So, with that strength of bhakti yoga, if they remember me and visualize me between the eyebrows at the time of their last breath, they will attain wealth or lordship equal to mine. Like that, Sri Krishna Paramatma is explaining the process of upasana or meditation that should be done by those who seek wealth or lordship from him. Keeping Sri Krishna Paramatma's teachings in mind, let's meditate on Sri Manarana or Sri Krishna Paramatma who has divine auspicious qualities and divine auspicious image and try to increase the strength of bhakti yoga. Let us try to repeat the words spoken by Sri Krishna Paramatma in the same way. Prayana kale manasa chalena bhaktiya yukto yoga balena chaiva bhruvor madhye prana mavesya samyak satam param purusham upaiti divyam The entire essence of Srimad Bhagavad Gita is given by Sri Krishna Paramatma in chapter 18, sloka 65 to 70 to do eight things. Sri Krishna says, I love those who follow these eight things. I'll protect those devotees in all kinds of ways. After listening to all of the Bhagavad Gita spoken by Sri Krishna Paramatma, Arjuna says, Karache Vachanam Tava, which means Krishna, I will do as you say. This is why Sri Krishna has bestowed Arjuna all kinds of successes and victories. Let's give Paramatma our vow that we will observe these eight actions. There is no puja, tapas, or yagna that is greater than giving this word to Paramatma. I will say these eight vows we should make. You all please think these in your mind and heart. In this way of us giving Sri Krishna our word, let us all visualize Sri Krishna's face beaming with joy and full bliss. Jai Sri Manarana. These are our eight promises. Our first promise. O Sri Manarana, as you instructed, I will always meditate upon and think of you. Our second promise. O Sri Manarana, as you advised, I will always be your devotee. Our third promise. O Sri Manarana, I will perform all my actions as service to you and for your satisfaction. Our fourth promise. O Sri Manarana, as you said to follow, I have great faith that I belong to you and I will always join my hands together and do namaskaram to you and worship you. Our fifth promise. O Sriman Narna, I recall your words, Mam Ekam Sharanam Raja, that you said to surrender to you alone. Sriman Narna, I surrender to you alone. Our sixth promise, O Sriman Narna, I recall your words, Ma Sujaha, that you are giving us reassurance to not grieve. I shall no longer grieve. 
our seventh promise. O Srimad Narayana, you have graced and blessed us all by delivering Srimad Bhagavad Gita for our sake. I promise to read or listen to it at least one sloka daily. Our eighth promise. O Srimad Narayana, you delivered Gita to all humanity. I will try to spread your divine words in Gita to those devotees who are unfamiliar with Gita. We just made our eight promises to Paramatma. Giving Srima Narayana a word each day that we will do as he says itself is a great puja. Let's give him a promise with our unshakable faith. O Srima Narayana, I will do as you say, I will behave as you wish, and I will work only for you. Srima Narayana Karashe Vachnam Tava Which means Srima Narayana, I will act according to your instructions. Sarvam Sri Krishna Paramastu Jai Srima Narayana Prayana Kale Manasa Chalena Bhaktiya Yukto Yoga Balena Chaiva Bhruvor Madhye Pranam Avesya Samyak Satam Param Purusham Vupaiti Divyam Om Prayana Kale Manasa Chalena Bhaktiya Yukta Yoga Balena Chaiva Bhruvor Madhye Prana Mavesya Samyak Satam Param Purushamupaiti Divyam Jay Sri Manarana, a special request to all devotees. In all things in our life, we want immediate and effective results. To achieve this, let's spend one minute daily and read Naranastram. In order to obtain Naranastram, go to Naranastram website which is www.narayanastram.org and provide your name and email in the registration. You will receive a Narayanastram PDF to the email you provided. In the PDF, there is a Ramayana Sloka, a Gita Sloka, and a Vishnu Nama. The three of these put together is called Narayanastram. Everyone receives a different combination of these Slokas. When everyone reads or listens to their Narayanastram daily, along with 24,000 devotees, one round of Sampuna Ramayana Parayana, 33 rounds of Srimad Bhagavad Gita Parayana, 24 rounds of Sri Vishnu Sahasrama Strotra Parayana is completed every day. This is such a remarkable and extraordinary outcome that comes out of doing this every single day. That's why you and your family members immediately go and obtain your Narayanastram. Jai Sri Manarayana. <laughs>